What's up, guys? We're taking a look at some more NBA player props today over on Prize Picks. This week applies to Prize Picks, but also sports books and other player prop sites out there. And we're going to dive into a pretty nice nine game slate today. So hopefully, you find some value today and cash out. If you are not already on Prize Picks and want to join, now is the best time to do so because we have a Patrick Mahomes free square on the board at half a passing yard. Also, if you use code DUMG, which you can see right here, you get a 100% deposit match up to $100 using my code DUMG. It's available in most states and most of Canada, 18 years and older, but let's now dive into today's video. If you want to see everything that I am playing tonight, the link for my Patreon is down in my description below. Here's a full breakdown of my Patreon where there are over 500 members. If you are interested in seeing every single one of my plays, check out the Patreon. The link is down in the description below. There are three different tiers. There's NFL, NBA, and all sports. With access to the Patreon, you guys get every single play that I play on top of these plays being ranked by confidence level and write-ups to go with every single prop that I post. Once again, the link is down in the description below. So check it out. You can also go ahead and follow my Twitter. You guys can see plays. If I have a play of the day that I feel is like a lock, I'll post that over on my Twitter. So that is DOMG props over on Twitter. I believe the link for that is also down in my description below. So, so for the links for everything, the prize picks, uh, Patreon, those are all down in the description below. But we're going to go ahead and dive into the slate. But final thing, just make sure you leave a like on the video and subscribe to the channel and have those post notifications on so you do not miss out before these end up getting bumped. But let's hop in now to player prop number one. And this one's going to be a popular play today, but I absolutely absolutely love this prop man it's gonna be clay thompson over 25.5 points this one will probably get bumped i like him to 26.5 if he gets bumped to like 27 27.5 i probably would stay away right there personally but i love the spot with him being at 25.5 patreon members got this early if you have your post notifications on for these youtube videos you should be able to get that one in as well if you do want to make sure you always tail your risk and look into these props a little bit more on your own but clay thompson right here this is a pretty damn good value because he's at 26.5 on sports books at a minus 125 and a minus 132 go over. Yet he's at 25.5 on prize picks. So really, really good value right off there. And I also just love the spot for him tonight. This tool, by the way, is the DGF Optimizer. I have this for plenty of different apps. Prize picks, Underdog, Thrive, No House Advantage, FanDuel, and DraftKings. This is an amazing tool. If you want to research player props, this is the number one tool, in my opinion, that I absolutely love. It's the DGF Optimizer. Link is down in my description below for that. Using my link gets you $5 off, by the way. But anyways, diving back into the Warriors game here with uh, Clay Thompson. He's a shooting guard, and he's facing the Los Angeles Lakers today. He's been on fire, by the way, this season without Stephen Curry, at least in the last six games is what I mean. So in the last six games here, he's at 31, 42, 30, 54, 31, and 29 points. And he's had 22 plus attempts in all of those six games. He's even had 25 attempts against Memphis, but shot 32%. Please do not let that be tonight. But I think, I don't think the Lakers are going to stop him tonight. I don't think the Lakers have the firepower to stop him. I don't think Malik Beasley is going to lock Klay Thompson down that much. It's a three-point spread and a 238 and a half over-under, by the way. So the over-under is really, really high. They're expecting a lot of points to be scored. And they're also not expecting this game to blow out with a three-point spread. So Vegas is liking this game to go the distance and have a lot of points scored. So that's good news for Klay Thompson. Thompson. Uh, this should be pretty good right there. But if you take a look at how the shooting guard matches up against the Lakers with all the trades, man, I mean, this is kind of a little bit tougher to look at with the matchups because like, obviously the Lakers didn't have Malik Beasley uh, or D'Angelo Russell. So the defense is going to be a little bit different for the Lakers today, but nonetheless, we'll take a look at how the Lakers match up in the last seven games here. Kind of right in the middle of the pack, allowing 22.73 points per game to the shooting guard in the last seven games. So it's a little bit different right there when you take a look at it, but uh, yeah, because they got Beasley and Russell now, but I'm not really worried about those guys. I think Lake Thompson can go ahead and drop hopefully at least 26 points here, or if you get like him at 26.5, hopefully he drops 27, but that's pretty much my first player prop right there and Clay Thompson. I absolutely love the value, like I said, with him being at 25.5 on prize picks, but 26.5 on sports books, heavily juiced on the over. Just great value when it comes to the prize picks board. And we're actually going to dive in now for the second player prop to an NHL prop. And if you hate me for posting an NHL player prop in this video, don't worry. I will have a lean of an NBA play after the NHL player prop. But this is my other official play in today's video. I've really been loving the NHL. Sometimes it uh, treats you pretty well. Sometimes uh, maybe your guy has two shots on goal in the first period. He needs three, doesn't do rest in the next two. But anyways, we're diving into an NHL player prop here. And I'm going to go down to the Dallas Stars game and find Machen Marchment over two shots on goal here against the Tampa Bay Lightning today. He's averaging two in his last five games here, hoping he can drop three today on the Tampa Bay Lightning. So let's dive in, take a look at why I like Mason 
enlargement today. So he's a minus 190 to go over 1.5. So he's really, really, really juiced to have at least two shots on goal. But I think he, he can get three today, man. So he's over this in 53% of games this season. This is where you take a look at his shots, by the way. If you can see my uh, cursor right here, that's where the shots are. But uh, take a look at what he's done really this season. So he's over in 53% this season and four out of six of his last 10 games. And he did have three last time he faced the Lightning this season. If we can scroll down to where he faced the Lightning this season. Actually, we'll just take a look at it right here. So back in November, he had three shots on goal against them. Uh, shooting actually 33%. So I think he had nine attempts in that game, which is pretty crazy uh, with 16 uh, total minutes on ice. But otherwise, even dating back to like previous seasons, like last season, he actually was over in two out of three last season, including the latest two with three and four. So he was over in three straight games against this Tampa Bay Lightning team, even when he was with the Florida Panthers. But he's just been really good lately too. Like I said, he's over in four out of six of his last 10. He's only been under this two times in his last 10 games. So there is a lot of push potential here. I know a lot of people aren't a big fan of pushes. I don't think they're the end of the world. I obviously like when there's, uh, I like I like the spots where there's like push potential, but there's a lot of uh, value for the player to potentially go over on their prop. That kind of makes sense. So I like Mason Marchman a lot today to go over his two shots on goal. That's my NHL play for today and clearly my favorite NHL play on the board. We'll see if there is more at the end of the day. But anyways, let's dive in though and take a look at the NBA lean because I know a lot of people still want some NBA plays and are not a big fan of the NHL. The NBA and NHL communities aren't exactly connected, so I will say that. But let's dive in, though, to an assist category prop here. And this is going to be like a lean for me. It's not an official play or anything like that, but I do like Darius Garland over 7.5 assists. I know the last five is not a great look. He's, he's only averaging uh, 6.8 in his last five games, and he did actually sell me last game. I took him over his points, and he played, uh, you know, 23 minutes because he had seven first half minutes. So thanks, shout out to Darius Garland for uh, selling me on my points last night. But... Darius Garland right there at 7.5 assists. I like the spot for him. If you take a look at the optimizer, again, that shows you that it's some pretty decent value. He's, he's a minus 140 to go over this on DraftKings. So pretty damn good in my opinion. I like the minus 140 uh, with, for him to go over on DraftKings and him still being at 7.5 on prize picks. I assume this one will get bumped eventually, uh, Darius Garland, but he's facing the Bulls today. The Bulls are not a crazy matchup or anything like that. If you take a look at like his assists they, that uh, the Bulls are allowing, they're kind of like right in the middle of the pack, kind of towards the bottom right there. 8.02, but Garland is just such a good player when it comes to his assists. He's really consistent. His minutes have been inconsistent lately because of things like foul trouble and things like that, like obviously last game, but I like the spot for uh, Garland nonetheless. I think it's some pretty good odd value. I don't hate the matchup for Chicago, even if it says it's going to be a tougher one on paper. I think Darius Garland can get this one done, and like I said, like five times. I like the odds on this one, so the odds are really favoring his over right there. That's going to do it. Thank you guys for watching. All the links are down in my description below. The Patreon, if you want to see everything that I'm playing tonight, if you want to check me, if you want to check out Prize Picks, use the link down in my description below. Uh, and use code DOMG because that could be 100% deposit match up to $100. If you want to research your player props, man, this is one of, if not the best site to use, especially when it comes to these apps, obviously, and even sports books. The DGF Optimizer, the link is down in my description below for that. And using my link gets you $5 off. But uh, that's going to do it. Thank you guys for watching. And hopefully, I will see you guys back here tomorrow. Hopefully, we go 2 0 and 3 0 with the lean uh, coming back tomorrow. Thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys next one. Tail turn risk. Peace out, boys. Thank you guys for watching.